It happened since we last recorded. The NFL draft deadline has come and gone. So we know now the players that have declared early for the NFL draft. We have a number out of, out of the SEC. I think NIL, though, has certainly helped some players stay in college. So I, I think yet another aspect that NIL is possibly helping SEC in college football. And two teams in particular – Following the deadline, I got some winners and losers following the deadline to declare for the NFL draft. I think the biggest winner out of the SEC, South Carolina. You get Spencer Rattler back, getting receiver Juice Wells back, offensive tackle Jalen Nichols is back, and cornerback Marcellus Dial. Four key contributors that could have declared early for the NFL draft back in Columbia to anchor year three under Shane Beamer. I think South Carolina fans, you ought to be doing cartwheels for what your team was able to pull off at the end of the season, obviously, and now that momentum carries over with these players making their declarations of return. And one other team out of the SEC East as well, the Missouri Tigers. Some surprising returns here for Mizzou. Chris Abram Drain, Enos Rakestraw, Tyron Hopper, the linebacker, Darius Robinson. If I'm a Mizzou fan, I'm pretty fired up. We're going to be disrespected, going to be under the radar. And clearly, if you listen to this show, you know Missouri's defense, criminally underrated, the strongest unit on the field for the Tigers last season. And with a lot of these players, and Maybe Trajan Jeffcoat, who he announced he's coming back. He announced he's in the portal. Looked like he was going to South Carolina. Doesn't look like that's happening now. Maybe he returns. I don't know if he's welcome back after all this jumping around. But can you blame him? He's from South Carolina. I think he's even from Columbia. So maybe we're getting even Jeffcoat back, which would be another boost to this Missouri defense. Big winners from the NFL draft deadline here. Now, 